I spray painted a wood heart in XOXO red. Then I added Mod Podge and glitter, glued the XOXO onto the heart, I painted the XOXO with the Mod Podge and glitter mix, and then I glued on vase filler in red, white, and pink all over the heart. They looked like small little gumballs, so it gave it a super fun look. I put the string back on, and then it was ready to hang. I spray painted a Dollar Tree cake pan black, then I had a Valentine's Day cake topper cut off the stem and Mod Podged it to the back of a clear plate. Then I added some silver glitter, and then I did the same to the top of the cake pan, and then I stuck that plate right on there and trimmed it with heart ribbon. I added glitter hearts around it, and now I have this cute cupcake stand or cake stand all from Dollar Tree stuff. I painted a heart pink and then I dabbed it to give it a little bit of a textured look, added the string back on, and then I glued on wood beads all around the heart. It gave it a nice natural element. I took a metal heart and some scrapbook paper along with some rub-ons that had Valentine's Day words and put them all on there and then it was ready to hang. Another Dollar Tree winner. I took a couple of laser cut hearts and painted them silver and a metallic pink. Then I put packing tape on the back of them. To give them a good seal, I burnished them. Then I added resin and red glitter and put them into all of the openings. It takes a little time, but it is totally worth it. And if you drip any on the wood, just wipe it off before it cures. I used a lighter to pop all of the bubbles and I moved quick because obviously it's wood. And then I removed the packing tape off of the back and I had beautiful coasters. Look how pretty they are. I had a silver plastic charm and pink sequins. So I mixed some resin and added the sequins, poured it in my coaster mold and moved them around, hit it with a lighter to get rid of the bubbles added the heart and then I put some more resin on top. Popped more bubbles and then all of a sudden I had this beautiful pink and silver coaster. I had black and white vellum and a cutout of love and I traced around a cork circle to cut out my vellum. I added glitter and resin to my coaster mold, spread it around, popped any bubbles with a lighter. I let it cure for a bit. I had painted the love red, then I added more resin, slid in the vellum, pressed it down to make sure there weren't any bubbles underneath it, popped any bubbles with the lighter, added the love, pressed that down as well, popped the bubbles, added another layer of resin, popped more bubbles, then I ended up with a beautiful love coaster. This one's a little more unusual. I had some resin and added some chia seeds. Mixed it up good, and then I poured it into the coaster mold. I popped the bubbles with a lighter, and then I added another layer just to make it sure it was nice and smooth. And then I cut out a heart with vinyl, with permanent vinyl, and I stuck it right onto the coaster, and there it is, all done. But look at that cool background with the chia seeds.